Hi, Pastor Nathan Decker with your hashtag Better Together devotion for today. And this week I've really been focusing on just the basics of discipleship in terms of grace and salvation's journey and all the things that Jesus expects of us as disciples as a part of this journey. And one of the ways that we are also called to, to experience grace is to be beloved and to belong and to be love. We're called to be beloved. In other words, that, that is really hard, I think, for most of us. Most of us in some childhood fashion or teenage years have experienced events or traumas that, that have dumped guilt and shame on our lives, and it's hard for us to acknowledge that someone, especially God, who knows every single thing about me, every hair I don't have on my head, that he, will, he calls me beloved. God looks at you and says, you are beloved. And that's hard because we know ourselves. It's hard for us to love ourselves. We know ourselves. And we're called to be beloved. And we're called to belong. We're called to create a tribe of love around us. A group of people who protect us from bullies. A group of people who empower us to rise and be better than we were yesterday. Who help us on this journey of grace. We're called to belong. That's called church as disciples. We're called to be a part of a group where we are comfortable uh, letting it all out and, and being vulnerable and sharing who we are. We're called to belong. And we're called to be love. We're called to, to go about our lives in the world in such a way as that people take notice that we are sharing that living water, sharing that love, sharing who Jesus is by being the incarnation of who the body of Christ is today. And where we work and, and what we say and how we encourage and how we uplift people, if we find ourselves in difficult times, if we find ourselves having problems being that way, I want to remind you to say these three B's. I am beloved. I belong. And I am called to be love. If we can turn the narrative around to where we let go of the guilt and shame and forgive ourselves, and we let go of the guilt and shame and forgive others, and experience the beloved nature of God, and to experience the belonging of what it means to be a part of a tribe called love, to be a part of being love in the world. Oh man, that'll make it better together. Remember this when you have problems, when you have that moment of doubt, where you need to grow and where God is stretching you. You are beloved. You belong, and you are called to be love. Amen.